Hi guys, welcome to my English channel. So today I'm gonna show you a really cool trick, an easy trick on how to make your lashes look longer as if you had false lashes on. And it's super easy and it makes such a big difference. So I really hope you like it and let's get started. All right, so let's do this. I'm really excited um, because it's such a easy trick that you can do at home. Everybody has a spoon at home, so that's what we're gonna need, a spoon. It could be a bigger one or a smaller one. It depends on your eye size. Since I have a little bigger of eye, I'll use a bigger spoon. Then you're gonna use your favorite mascara and a little trick at the end too, uh, which is probably gonna enhance your lashes more, will be using a Curvex. Okay, so that's all we're gonna need. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the mascara, I don't usually curve my lashes before, I like to curve them after I apply the mascara. So I'm gonna use my Clinique High Impact Extreme Volume Mascara and I'm gonna take the spoon and I'm gonna place it, kind of pull it like really close to my lash root. And the reason we use the spoon is because it's gonna prevent the mascara from touching your lid. And that's, I feel like a lot of girls get scared of, you know, really applying the mascara on because sometimes, a lot of times, it touches the lid. So because we're like so carefully applying it, um, you don't really give it the full effect. So that's why the spoon is gonna help us so much. So I start really close to the lash root until the end of your lashes. And I'm gonna use my Perversion Mascara by Urban Decay that gives length and volume. I'm gonna take the spoon and really pull in my lid and really apply it from the root until the end of your lashes. And if you have a hard time using the spoon, you can even use like a tube, a squeezing tube like this. So see, you're already getting so much volume because you're actually applying the mascara from the root until the end of your lashes. And you can keep applying it until you feel like it's done. So right after I apply the first coat, I'm gonna come in with a Curvex, really close to your root and squeeze it. So it really curves your lashes. And after I do that, I come back with a little bit more and just touch it up. I'm gonna apply a little bit on the bottom lashes. And now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. And like I said, the spoon or the squeezing tube, it's a blocker for the mascara not to touch your lid because I feel like, you know, a lot of girls are scared of, of really applying um, the mascara from the root to the top because they get scared it's gonna mess up the eye or the shadows or even like just getting a smudge. So this is a blocker, right? And really to tell you guys the truth, I feel more comfortable using the tube um, than the spoon because the spoon, it curves. Um, but I mean, some girls like the spoon better. You can do it either way. So try both. So now I'm gonna curl it. And I always curl, I always curl my lashes after the mascara is on because it gives a better effect. So that's it, that's how your lashes are gonna look like. Very long, full, with volume and length. And it's super easy. Uh, the blocking thing, you know, with a spoon or the tube is really gonna help you out blocking, you know, the mascara, your lashes from your lid so that you don't get any smudges. So I really hope you like this quick tip. And before we go, I wanna teach you a Portuguese word. Today I'm gonna teach you how to say trick. So in Portuguese you say truque. Really easy, right? Repeat with me, truque. 
Really hope you liked it. Please don't forget to rate the video, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Stay beautiful. Bye.